the place for comic book and anime reviews. Hey there, you guys, I'm on the Brandon Campbell 12 YouTube channel. Please follow your comic book anime reviews. Here's my review of The Mighty Valkyries issue number one. Also, legacy number issue number 15. So, we haven't talked about Jane Foster in a while on this channel. Uh, I haven't put, I guys know, I've been kind of a little bit lagless on the videos as well. Um, kind of just taking my time with each video a little bit more while I'm doing it. More when I feel like I'm probably going to upload a little bit more um, this week than I usually do. Because I've seen a whole bunch I want to talk about a whole bunch. Um, and I'm mostly done with most stuff, most work stuff. Um, but I'm still, I'm still here. I'm still going to be reviewing comics when I can. And, um, yeah, so let's talk about the Mighty Valkyries, issue number one. So with the issue of Valkyrie, we continue with this great art, uh, throughout the story, who the artist is, uh, um, Erica D'Urso, with colorists, but the colors are really great, Marcio Mianis. Uh, cause those two things are really gorgeous throughout this book. Um, as Valkyrie has been for quite some time, having this gorgeous art style with gorgeous looking um, paneling and facial structures and everything about the art is throughout the book really beautiful looking. And I really love it a lot, just how gorgeous every panel looks um, throughout the book. So, um, yeah, gorgeous looking book, really pretty, really nice looking. I really enjoy the artwork within the book. So, getting to the actual story comes into the book, uh, we get to a lot of Doctor Strange and Jane Foster kind of, um, having a discussion about this monster that has appeared in the town and Jane Foster kind of going to go after it so she talks to her boss pretty much and her boss is really not happy with this whole ordeal that she's putting out there like you're gonna go adventuring again to my bar um but it's only me and people who work in the morgue and i just well i work in the morgue too now no you know he, he makes already like no you know you just got demoted here you don't work here really uh, you haven't been here for a while. I have friends there. Please don't ruin my reputation there. And I thought that was really going to go somewhere when she got to the morning place. Um, they don't know what's happening because she does meet another guy while she's there. And they had to have like a little discussion. Going to get back to that one in a second. Um, we didn't cut over to see Hella in this issue uh, for a little bit. There's only one scene. Um, but it's a fun little moment of getting to see in this series and then we kind of cut the way we continue the conversation with these two only for them to go outside and this, was, this really surprised me quite a bit when I saw it because we find out that the person who has who was talking to Jay Potter in that little bar was in fact Loki Loki kind of changes and becomes that guy, and James like has a sword out, like she, she already knew it was him, and it's a really shocking moment. Uh, at least for me, it was. I, I did not see that coming whatsoever. I really love that moment. Probably the best moment within the book. Uh, anyway, they end up fighting the beast that Doctor Strange was talking about. Um, and I guess it apparently belongs to Loki. Um, they end up fouling out with each other. Um, throughout the streets and uh, it ends with the new character kind of getting introduced at the very end of the book um, then you're seeing where that whole storyline ends up going uh, the rest of the book deals with other Valkyries um, in the Valkyrie myth because this is called the Mighty Valkyries um, they were all right stories uh, I didn't really grab onto them immediately I didn't really like care a whole whole lot again art still even these little parts of the book still pretty um but that's pretty much all i gotta say about the mighty valkyries for the most part um uh, pretty okay book interesting um wasn't my favorite thing to read but it was all right i definitely uh enjoyed reading this a bit uh even if it wasn't you know perfect so um yeah let me know in the comments about valkyries issue number one 
Um, leave a comment below you talk about this issue, and I will catch you guys later. Peace out.